Last week we ditched the washing machine and we replaced that awning finally. Let's hope the repairs are done for a while. Knock on wood. This week our tiny home is about to get a lot smaller. We're welcoming a guest and the adventures are gonna begin. I am Tammy and this is my husband Scott. We are two artists who when faced with mounting health challenges decided life's way too short. So we sold our home and moved into a home on wheels. We are now in our second year in an even smaller RV and along with Gracie and Jasper, we are crossing the country in search of new landscapes, experiences, and friends. We'd love to have you join us as we navigate our way through this full-time RV life. And until further notice, our mission is explore, create, and inspire. We're going to have a house guest. And you've seen her before if you've watched our videos. Our daughter Casey's coming to visit. She's leaving the family behind. She's going to come have some adult time with us. And that means our tiny home is about to get a little bit smaller. But it's okay. It's Casey. You're going to have to give up your couch. This is Casey's bed now. The living room back here will be the bedroom. But it'll be fun. It'll just be a big slumber party. All right, we're going to go pick her up. If we don't get going now, the Spanish moss, it just grew an inch while we've been waiting and getting our stuff ready. Let's get out of here. We're going to St. Augustine, baby. <laughs> the trolley tour and we're gonna do the hop on hop off but first we're gonna visit the oldest jail is it really the oldest jail oh god <laughs> i had that effect on people do how you doing on I, I don't know what youtube is ma'am it's 1908 oh i've been here like 20 months now <laughs> until you got about 10 more minutes of freedom Okay, 10 more minutes of freedom, and then you're gonna meet me right over there at that podium. I'm gonna be next. My name is Patrick, and we're gonna have a great time. All right, Patrick. I'm, st I'm still trying to figure out what this tube view thing is. <laughs> we're going to jail. All right, now which one of y'all thought it was gonna be a good idea to bring all them donkeys up to the top floor last night? Was it you? So, when Smarty Pants over here needs a little behavioral readjusting, which I assume quite often now. <laughs> Kelly ma'am, Keith reached out in a breakdown of each and every stop throughout the city showing you not just where you are but what's around you at each stop. Thank you, Bill. I don't know how you get any studying done here. It's beautiful. You know what this reminds me of though is I have recurring nightmares to this day that I'm signed up for a class and I don't go the whole semester and it's final day. I have, you I have, have the same dream. You have those dreams? So when this was a hotel, it sold out for thousands of dollars a night. The students are probably very annoyed with us in their study space, so we're gonna move on, but man, I wish we could see this when it was a hotel. This Flagler guy, I'm telling you, he, uh, he owned the whole town. In this cemetery, you had to be Catholic. 
and by the way they stacked the bodies on top of each other so apparently you were in a good place if you were buried last and you got your name marker but there's a bunch of people buried underneath those people think about that think about that for a minute so we missed the trolley so we're having to walk back to the car but we're hoping to find Magnolia Street along the way beautiful and I want to stay in that house Augustine. Pretty cool. What was your favorite thing? Can I say the crab artichoke dip? Because <laughs> that was my favorite thing. <laughs> it was really pretty by the water. We're gonna wrap it up for this week, but just wait. Next week, we finally replaced our inflatable kayak, and it's about to get crazy. We're gonna go on an epic adventure with Casey down the Silver River. Can you say manatee? and huge alligators. And did you know there's monkeys in Florida? Wild monkeys. Everywhere, hundreds. Just wait. That'll be next week. We'll see you later. Whoa, look how beautiful. <laughs> <laughs> Have you seen that sunset? <laughs> I look like I'm in heaven. It's humid today, apparently.